What is up, everyone? I'm Bladen Kirk. I hope you all crushed it in your week two fantasy matchups and are equally as thrilled as I am to get ready for week three with my fantasy football stud prediction picks. This week, I have a quarterback, a receiver, and a tight end. And normally, when I'm looking at these skill position players, I have a lot of guys that I have in mind as like high level players that could have an elite fantasy performance. And usually I'm just picking the guys where I don't think the defense quite speaks to me. Now with quarterback, it's a little bit different. That can vary from week to week, but we're just going to hop right into the quarterback, Josh Allen. Everyone's consensus QB one for a reason. He is an absolute freak of nature with a huge arm. He has that dog in him to really just fight for extra yardage when he's running. I I think he's going to be absolutely phenomenal. And we saw last week, who played Miami? The Baltimore Ravens. And Lamar Jackson shredded them, even though they lost. Lamar was terrifying to play against. And I think Buffalo has better weapons with Diggs. And hopefully Gabe Davis is back and Dawson Knox. You have a lot that you can go to for that matchup. So I like Josh Allen a lot in Week 3 against the Miami Dolphins. Moving on, talking about the Baltimore Ravens. I like Mark Andrews a lot. Mark Andrews is kind of underrated in my opinion. I think when people are doing their fantasy drafts, you think of Travis Kelsey, you might think of Kyle Pitts, but Mark Andrews sometimes doesn't come up in that same conversation. I think he's just as good as all of these guys at receiver, you know, as a receiving threat at tight end. I look at Mark Andrews as someone that could really go off against the Patriots, and he's been special already this year. He led all tight ends in receiving last year. The Patriots defense just doesn't speak to me. It really doesn't. I look at the defense. I'm like, who's going to guard him? Duggar? I I, I don't think Duggar's going to really have much to say there. Maybe he does, but I think Mark Andrews kind of has his way against the New England Patriots defense, and he has a great game. And then last but not least, someone who maybe you wouldn't expect to have a breakout performance, but I'm going to pick him anyway. Michael Thomas has had three touchdowns already this season despite having kind of a limited workload you think about the teams that he's played so far the Bucks, where right out of the gate they said he was gonna have a limited snap count and then against the Falcons who have AJ Terrell he's been able to put up three touchdowns already this year I expect them to eventually get him really involved in this offense and I think this could be the week they do it against the Carolina Panthers Again, another defense that just does not speak to me. They had a little bit of hype coming into this season, but they have not really performed up to that level thus far, I don't think. So the Panthers defense doesn't really speak to me. Michael Thomas is bound to get super involved eventually. He's proven to be an effective target. I like him a lot, and those are my three fantasy football stud picks. Josh Allen, Mark Andrews, and of course, Michael Thomas, Ohio State legend. Michael Thomas. Wish you all the best of luck in your week three matchups. I'm sure you're all going to kill it. And until next time, again, I'm Bladen Kirk, and thank you all for tuning in.